Hey, I'm Benson and um, I've chosen to introduce myself this way because I'm more comfortable talking than the writing today at least. And um, yeah, it's that time of the day, so cheers to some tea. And um, I'm going to try to answer questions on the page or on the WhatsApp note. And I'm also going to answer some other questions. Um, I'm, sat, I'm located in Sunnydale. Uh, right next to Harry Gumans and uh, Green Gorillas and um, I we, we've only been here for less than a year and I'm going to just go back a bit to tell us to tell you where I moved from so that you could get the picture as to why things are in, in the state that they're in uh, before this we were in Denken Welcome Glen more specifically and there we had a vegetable patch we had compost multiple compost piles and we had multiple worm farms as well as chickens for eggs and slaughter um, we've transported the chickens and we've separated them out into two systems we've transported the worms trans uh, into two systems transported out the compost pile into one system so the compost pile is a test site where I do a few things <clears throat> the first thing that I just need to say to you that because of where we were located we were um, our worst enemy back then was baboons and porcupine which forced me into containers and um, right now I'm looking at a range of containers to our far right is a pile of um, plastic crates that have been planted out and then some other sweet peas and then some lots and lots of seedling trays so the lots and lots of seedling trays there's lots of kale there's some onion there's lots and lots of spinach um, I enjoy the seeding and propagation part and that's where it ends I suppose I um, need to yeah so, so besides the, the introduction as to where I farmed first and how I got forced into container um, space I also am a trained minister so I spend a fair amount of time ministering to young people in church and in community context and my latest stint I worked as a skills trainer for a Catholic welfare organization. I also have the interest in guerrilla art, formerly known as guerrilla gardening. And I've got a few sites that I've started and co manage and I will include some of the sites in a little link somewhere in this thing, video thing. Um, the other space that I enjoy is the online space. So I do enjoy TikToking and YouTubing and Google mapping because I think that that just elevates what we do and invites other people in. Um, so let me try and answer some of the real questions that's put in front of me. Um, yeah, so you know what I'm growing? I'm growing seeds of everything. And what is unusual? They are seeds. Um, once they hit a certain stage, I give them away. I tried selling them, but that didn't work, so I just give them away. Um, yeah, the worst enemy, the, yeah, we've got two worst enemies on the site. The first one is crows, and I just found out that the crows have smelt blood on the chickens, so I have to change my approach to them. And then I've also got uh, two big dogs on the site. I found here yeah. so yeah that's a battle ongoing battle my hopes for 2021 is to s facilitate a few more uh, food gardens and keep in the space that I'm in and yeah I'm quite happy to be in this group I will and I'm looking forward to collaborating on, on a bigger scale so thanks for listening and thanks for the invitation.